Welcome to the 10-Minute Business Advantage, volume number three. Hi, I'm Andreas Becker. And after more than 10 years in sales and marketing, I've noticed something really interesting. What I've noticed is that there are really only four keys to success in marketing. And the first one is obviously generation, is attracting the right type of people to your business. And secondly, is converting some of these into paying clients. And then it is to to create a lot of repeat and referral sales. This is a great area to focus on because it's very effective and doesn't cost you a lot of money. Referrals are great to, to basically grow your business. And then finally, we have um, creating a competitive advantage. This is where you stand out. You're creating something that is different from all your competitors and you're not competing on price. Now, in each of these 10-minute business advantage videos, you learn one simple strategy to help you to get better results in one or more of these four keys to marketing success. Today, I'm going to share with you the third strategy, and that is how to get magic quotes. Here's why you should be using magic quotes. First, you will get a better conversion rate. Isn't that great if you can get a better conversion rate for without having to spend a lot of money. You can then also focus on your ideal clients that give you the highest chance of winning. Rather than, have, if you have a poor conversion rate, you have to get out so many quotes, hoping that you will get some. And guess what? Some of them will be with people that you don't actually like doing business with and they will actually be really hard on you and your business. And that is not ideal. So this will overcome that. And also, you will have a great point of difference because nobody else is doing this. And it is very low cost or almost no cost. Once you've set it up and done it, you can benefit from that forever and use it again and again in your business to get you a better conversion rate. So here's why you should be using magic quotes. The, the second reason why you should be doing that. You can achieve a higher price. So if you can achieve a higher price, it will give you a higher margin. Isn't that great? And if you have a higher margin, you will actually have a better business because that's what you all that's why you're in business. You are there to make money out of your business. And if you have a better business, you automatically have better clients. Better clients help you to make that better business. And you will have a better team because you can pay them better and they will be attracted. Better people will be attracted to your business. Everything starts going better and easier. That's what it's all about, isn't it? So Here's some more reasons why you should be using magic quotes. A small change will sometimes give you a huge difference. And let me show you an example here. So imagine this is what you're doing right now. You're selling some something for $100 and the total cost to you is $90. So you're making a profit of $10. This is quite typical for quite a few businesses, especially if you're in the construction industry because you're talking of obviously on a, on a lot of dollars here you can just multiply that by a hundred and you'll you might be seeing exactly those type of results say now you increase your prices through creating amazing quotes to a hundred and ten dollars your cost is still the same and now your profit has gone up to twenty dollars how much increase have you just created to in your business you've created an increase in profit of a hundred percent because if you take ten percent a ten dollars here to ten dollars an increase in ten dollars here that gives you exactly a hundred percent now that is brilliant without costing you a lot of money you can now work half for the same amount of profit that you've done before or for the same amount of work that you've done in the, before you will double your profit and that is brilliant so this is the way to do it let me show you how it's done so the first thing that you need to realize is why do people actually buy now, you might think that people buy on logic and reason, but it's only 10% of people that buy on that. This is typically price or something very specific, the, 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 the size of something or anything like that. But very few people actually buy on that. We all buy. 90% of our decisions are made on emotions. This is the feelings that we have, the, the how, how will it make us safer? Is it, is it, do we get a better guarantee? All those kind of things really make a difference. And then we justify with logic and reason. So we need to understand and use emotions to make us a better sale. And this is how, what I want to show you, obviously, with the magic quotes. So the first thing is, you must have no price breakdown. So if you look at this quote here on the right, you'll see 
This is a typical quote that many people use. It's got all the prices broken down and everyone is doing this. And that is great for in some, some ways because you can now stand out. You can only then compete on price because in the end, this is all the person sees is the price. And the other thing that will happen, people start comparing items by item. So you can see a removal of old kitchen is $700. And if your quote, another quote is $500, they will try and cut you back by $200. Even though you might actually be cheaper in some other areas, they will try and cut that $200 back. And they, by right, that makes sense. Why shouldn't they? And that sucks. You should not do that. So basically, a better quote can win you completely if, if someone offers a better quote. Alternatively, you, you get these quotes so cheap because you're winning these quotes and you're competing on price, you probably go broke in the end. And that's not a good thing to be in business. So here's an example of a great quote. We focus on the benefits and we have a detailed specifications here about and we think about it, what's in it for them rather than, you know, what's in it for you. And we have images if possible. This one obviously doesn't have images and we have only one price. And this is a completely com different picture. Your quote will stand out and you have a good chance of winning that. You can also offer upgrades. Upgrades are great for, you know, you, you just think of all the possible things that people could have want in addition to what they've been asking and you include detailed specifications and benefits and you have a price for each upgrade and upgrades are great for any business you make a lot of money out of that and you need to con always think of that so um, how do you actually use these you do not email these quotes that that's is really the number one rule it really sucks you need to deliver them in person so that you can make a sale if you're there and you can go in detail through these quotes with the people in person, you have a much, much higher chance of making a sale rather than just flicking it out like on email, what everyone else is doing. So you need to definitely change that. And the good thing is because you're focusing and you've got really good quotes, you do not need to provide that many quotes. You only provide quotes to ideal clients. That's how this whole system works. Once you've done this, you've actually created three different areas where you're competing really well. First is your sales conversion. Obviously, you're getting a better conversion. You will get much more repeat business and also better referrals from people that have received your great, great quotes. They think, wow, this is awesome. I want to work with this person. And you've created a competitive advantage because you stand out. Here's your to-do list. You need to take some action. Start with thinking about the main benefits of doing business with you. Write these down. And then you need to spend some real quality time on focusing on an amazing design for your next quote. Now, this is not a 10 minute job. This is probably not an hour job. This is maybe a day, maybe two day job, but it's really worth it because you can then reuse it again and again. And obviously then you use it, you then test and measure. This testing and measuring is really important. So that basically you need to know what your conversion rate is so that when you refine it and keep refining it, you can see if it actually makes a positive difference. Every time you create a positive difference, you know you're going in the right direction. Now, you probably know that I'm a big fan of providing added value to people people whenever I can. So I've created a quote template, which is with before and after examples, similar to what I was showing you in the earlier examples. Now this guide is a really good start because it gives you good ideas for your own quote. You can copy and paste and, and refine it and make it your own thing. But this guide is unfortunately not for sale. However, you can receive it completely free in a handy digital format by sending an email to me at andreas at big-cheese.co.nz. I will send it to you instantly without, with my compliments. I've got another extra bonus for you. Over the next two weeks, I'm offering business owners a limited number of 45-minute quote review and advisory sessions. During these sessions, I will actually sit with you and go through your quotes and give you exact examples and ideas on how you could enhance your quotes. Now, this is ideal for business owners who quote on a regular basis, like if you're in the construction industry or anything like that, you will definitely want to take this up because this could make it such a big difference for your business. It's completely free of charge. All you need to do is contact me and we'll set a time, make a time for us to catch up and um, go through your quotes and make them work like magic. Now, thank you for watching the 10, 10 minute business advantage. And 
I'm going to create another one in a couple of weeks time and you should be receiving that very soon. And I look forward to hearing from you in the meantime. Thanks and have an awesome day. Bye for now.